Hey guys, welcome to DIY Crafts. In this video, I'm going to show you how to crochet these beautiful daisy flowers. So, let's get started. For this, I'm using yellow and white color for play yarns and a hook of size 2.5 mm. Let's begin with yellow color for center. Start with a magic loop. Now draw the yarn from the loop and chain 1. Now make 10 single stitches into the loop. Here, number of stitches depends on the number of petals you wanted for the flower. For every 2 stitches, it gives you 1 petal. So this means if you want 5 petal flower then make 10 stitches and for 6 petals make 12 stitches. Adjust the loop by pulling the tail end if needed. Now after making 10 single stitches, close the magic loop by pulling the tail end and slip stitch into the first stitch to complete the flower piece. Now change the color to white as shown. Now we are going to make petals. So let's begin with chain 4. Now make a DC only up to a half way. That means yarn over, insert the hook into the first stitch, draw the yarn and come out of first two loops. Stop it here and make another DC into the same stitch. Again it's only a half way. This brings three loops on the hook and these three stitches constitute the half of the petal and the remaining half goes into the second stitch. Again make a DC that is again half way and another DC. So complete we have five loops on the hook. Now grab the yarn and come out of all the five loops carefully. Now chain one to secure the stitches. Just like the beginning, we need to close the petal by making chain 4. Now make a slip stitch into the second stitch in the baseline. This completes the first petal of our flower. Now moving to the second petal, we have to make a slip stitch into the next stitch in the baseline. Start making the second petal. Just like the first, begin with chain 4, yarn over and make a DC halfway and another DC also goes into the same stitch. For the remaining half petal, go into the next stitch and make two more DCs. Grab the yarn and come out of all the five loops and chain one to secure the stitches. Continue by making chain 4 and slip stitch into the second stitch. This completes the second petal. Now slip stitch into the next stitch for the third petal. Watch it again. Just make chain 4, yarn over, insert the hook into the same loop and make a half DC and another half DC, the third half DC into the next stitch and another one. Come out of all the loops and chain 1 to secure. Now chain 4 and insert the hook into the same stitch to close the third petal. 
this completes the third petal now make another two petals in the same way I am on my last petal now so just simply chain four to close the petal and slip stitch into the base stitch now make chain one and cut the excess thread pull this tail in behind the flower and weave the ends carefully cut this yellow thread as well but leave 10 inch tail this tail helps us to add this applique to our projects and that's it these small flower embellishments are very easy to make and looks really cute make a bunch of these and gift them as keychains or you can even add them to all your projects like a baby frog shoes headband hat or any other projects see you in the next video thank you for watching please like the video share it and subscribe to DIY crafts